Hey everybody, on today's Doobie Feature, in honor of the holiday, we're watching a Charlie Brown Thanksgiving. And as you can see here, we're testing out a new co-host. Uh, he's either really terrified or having the best time of his life. Say hi, Jeff. He doesn't speak human. Welcome back to the Doobie Feature, I'm Justin. I'm Byron. I'm Derek. They thought they could replace me, but... No. It's not happening. We took we traded in our dog for a real dog. <laughs> OG <We> dog. Lied. <laughs> Jeff is actually Derek. I am so full right now from all the Thanksgiving. Oh man. Ceremonies. I was going to say all of the fun shenanigans and the sandwiches. Uh, what have you been making leftover sandwiches? Uh well, I mean, we didn't cook a turkey this year. So, yeah. Yeah. What'd you make this year? So, we just made like a bunch of vegetables and oh, like, still good. one of those still guys, toe furkies. <laughs> no, no, fuck a toe furkey, but no, because I don't like eating turkey. I don't eat. always make the turkey. Sometimes I make a prime rib. You know, sometimes I'll make a pork. Don't don't try to pretend you're excited. He's not. He's so healthy. He's a vegan guy. We're enjoying the turkey sandwiches. Turkey. He's enjoying the vegetable sandwiches. Sandwich boil. You already know. The you know, deal. when you were out it's at dinner down. and you were like, I got to go walk the dog. And you went to go like smoke a couple blunts before dessert. You came back. You ate your pumpkin pie. Hopefully you got a little bit of leftover pumpkin pie. And what what goes better with pumpkin pie than some 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 crystal crystal. Crystal, Crystal coma. 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 Crystal coma from the fate. This is what you do when you want to go for round two and three. This is exactly what you do. Was it, oh, you use the dealer buddy? Uh, yeah. The and dealer buddy in case. 20% off, <laughs> dealerbuddy.com. Use the code DB feature. 20% off? Did you know it was 20% off? Is that right? 20% off? We have confirmation, 20% oh, wow. off. You're giving it away. It's like CVS. I went to CVS the other yeah. day. I, had a, I used a $5 coupon, and then I got another $5 coupon. It's like, what? CVS, how can you afford this? What do you, I don't understand. You're going to go out of business. You can't do it. That's Today, okay. we're going to talk about, in honor of the holiday, <laughs> a Charlie Brown Thanksgiving. So possibly our, our first non-feature on the Doobie feature, kind but of. a made-for-TV special, 1973. Did you guys grow up with this? I did. I did. Dude, I, I did. wasn't around. Uh, that's for sure. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Not of this earth. <laughs> He was, he was not a figment of imagination. I don't even think point. I was a thought. I yeah. wasn't anything. You were, you were a plan to avoid Damn. at that point, probably. You know? <laughs> so what'd you but think it, about it? They were fucked up. That's what I thought. <laughs> they were some assholes. That's what I thought. <laughs> you, th you thought the kids were all rude? To that's, but that's the honest thing yes. about Peanuts. And that's the thing about these kids. Is like it, It's supposed to be like a more realistic, you know, at, at, at the time, I guess. Capturing of like how kids really uh, react to each other here. You hold it. Well, each I wouldn't say it was realistic. Episode. Oh yeah, because it was definitely slided a little bit. You know, into that fifties uh, <laughs> mentality. <laughs> I mean, you know, it came out in the seventies. But yeah. Charles Schultz was doing this for a long time. Charles Schultz, the creator, of the original comic. You know, I, I, my first familiarity with the Peanuts was like getting the Sunday paper and, and looking at the comic section and yeah. actually like reading the comics. Well, it was I mean, Snoopy. Like, this isn't very funny. Snoopy. That's when I think about. <laughs> You know, Charlie Brown, oh, I think about Snoopy and Woodstock and Charlie Brown. They're like literally the only thing yeah. I enjoyed about this little 30 minute segment. Which is was weird. Were like a couple minutes, okay. you know, so when you know what? basketball. Oh, we're going to get back around. into it. We're going to get back into that. Peppermint Patty's a stalker. <laughs> okay, yeah. She's a stalker. She's and, a stalker. Which I always, think? She's a stalker. I never, I never picked up on that as a kid because I was always, you know, she's always calling him Chuck and like they're very friendly and whatever. And I was always like, she doesn't even know his name. That's so stupid, you know? That's fucked up. That's she what doesn't it even is. know his name. They're supposed to be trying to herself. You know, but I always love, you know, they had the kids do the real voices and that's always been like a hallmark of uh, what makes, I think, the Peanuts so classic, you know, that that delivery that really is like that innocent delivery. You don't feel, you don't feel the innocence. I mean, the honestly, Peppermint and Patty looked like Peppermint and Pete the entire time. I was confused. Bro, I was high, what? Man. That's, that's just okay. the short haircut. There's that nothing wrong with that. The 70s, Not man. even the style. That's, I think, very progressive. No, because there were some other girls on that little the, short the Marcy, that sounded like a girl, but then you got Lucy. The Marcy. Lucy. No, no, but the Marcy relationship with, uh, not Peppermint, but with, not, not Peppermint Patty, you were just saying with her, very progressive for the time. You know what I'm saying. I don't know. Peppermint Chuck, more like it. I don't fucking yeah, know. Yeah, Peppermint Patty. Weird. She's not She's not very cool. Not very sweet. I don't yeah. know how she gets that nickname. Hey, but you, you know, know who was chill as fuck, though, was uh, the little piano player. <laughs> but, uh, oh, oh, yeah. yeah um, not boy. Linus. Not Linus. Um, no. Schroeder. The Schroeder, yeah. Yeah, of course. The boy with the piano, he'd be like... He was practicing for Christmas time because he does like the Christmas time is here song. Yeah. And he's like, you know, around Thanksgiving time, he's like really just getting his act together. Yeah. And then he's like, and then Christmas time comes, he's like, yeah. And Lucy was into him, right? I think so. Gosh, they really like had that. a lot of. 
That's like, that was a little bit weird. A lot of so, little relationships yeah, going, on. going on. They're kids. I thought it was about a boy. <laughs> you don't think of this stuff. I thought in it was real about life. a boy and his dog. I thought it was about you know. I didn't realize this is so short. It's like twenty five minutes. I guess yeah. watching it as a kid, they always padded it out. Oh my god! There's so yeah. many commercials. Well, and commercials. It was always a minimum yeah. an hour long. You know. Yeah. Commercials like ten minutes oh, alone. That's like the back then, thirty minutes is in reality like forty minutes. Like you think a thirty minute show is like really thirty minutes? No, it's like twenty minutes 20 plus what? ten minutes of like commercials and. Shit like that. <coughs> Crystal Cove from the Fave. TV is oh. a lie. <laughs> I don't know where that came from. This dude is woke as fuck right now. <laughs> <laughs> you all right? <laughs> what happened? No, no. <laughs> One episode of Charlie Brown and <laughs> it really it does it for you, man. Any other movie we watched. <laughs> So I was gonna say that this, earlier. This movie really got me triggered. You know, I really <laughs> I I should have a trigger warning for people who don't have beautiful families and uh, you know had didn't have great childhoods. No, the thing I was gonna say about the movies, I always kind of felt bad for Charles Schultz. You know, like like you're saying. So your favorite part of the movie is literally like this music video with like Snoopy where he's like arguing and dancing with the lawn chair and all that. Yeah, Snoopy like, and Woodstock, like, basically. Do you think Charles Schultz like watched that and he's like, what the fuck are they doing with my? What are they doing with my Snoopy, you know? What are they, this is fucking bullshit. Like, this is corny, what is, you know, like, I imagine he's like a crotchety old man. And it's just, I imagine it became something that he didn't intend it to always be, you know? But that becomes, it's like a Star Wars thing. Like, kids like the prequels, and we yeah. can say, like, we don't like the prequels, but, you know, if you ask Byron, his favorite movie is Attack of the Clones. So it's like, Fuck no. <laughs> it's okay. You don't have to look cool here, Byron. It's like it's kids okay. liking Jar Jar. Like, fuck Jar Jar. <laughs> I mean, look, all It would have been cartoons... cool if he was actually, ended up being the Sith at the end. That would have yeah. been cool. Like, but that's just internet fan theory. All the cartoons in the 70s were fucked up. Yeah. Like, Fat Albert. Come on. Yeah. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. Jesus well, that was Christ. A real, that was a, there weren't many voices like that at the time. I guess the same thing for Peanuts. There weren't many like uh, kid voices on screen. Mm -hmm. There weren't many uh, you know, things showcasing that yeah. at the time. Yeah. You know? Yeah. This... United Feature Syndicate. Wow. They, that's, they don't, I don't even know if they distribute it anymore. Yeah, that company was probably bought in the 80s by a... Uh, Belcom or something. Now probably they're probably owned by AOL at this point, and you know whatever Time Warner. Oh, where's where are these getting passed around to? Anywhere. On Somebody give me. Some, I'm, I'm hitting this elephant. This crystal coma is uh, hitting though. Yeah, sativa dominant hybrid. You see how what? It, Whoa! Chatty? Did you? Oh my God! Did you just say sativa? It's okay. You wouldn't have known if I didn't tell you. Oh. It's all right. You don't care. <laughs> <laughs> It'll help you. We'll stay up. We'll be eating later. What's your favorite leftover? Leave us a comment below. Do you have any fun stories about trying to uh, avoid your avoid your family while you're smoking during the uh, holiday season? What are you doing over there? No, because uh, uh, my mom smoke. smoked, so I mean, yeah. really, really, really. I didn't have to avoid. <laughs> no, I just no. kind of like snuck her weed. You know, I'll take a little oh, bit. Oh, I'm that. expected to be like yeah. the guy who supplies for everyone now at Thanksgiving. <laughs> if I if I'm in town for Thanksgiving, yeah, <laughs> it's like I'm everyone's <laughs> best friend. Everyone's like, oh, hey, how you doing, buddy? What are you doing? Did you bring anything for? Oh, okay, right, that's great. Hey, right, yeah. So we gonna go for that walk later, right? We gonna go to the store oh, later, boy, right? Man. Yeah. And then Grandma's like, "Do you smoke?" And you're like, "Not cigarettes, Grandma." You know, I'm a healthy boy. That's what I'm trying to say. <laughs> Look, this was classic for me. I don't know about anybody else. Is it your favorite uh, of the Charlie Brown holiday specials? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I don't think so. I great, like the Great Pumpkin Charlie Brown. I like Great Pumpkin. Yeah. yeah that's my joint. Yeah. That one's added a little bit of a difference to it. I, I mean, I don't know. This one just doesn't really have a lot going on. They, they serve the world's weirdest Thanksgiving meal. They well, served yeah. them like... Man. <laughs> well, then, <laughs> he then, gets then, all upset because he made him a meal of toast and... Uh, what was it? Popcorn and toast and pretzel man. sticks or some shit? <laughs> what was that? Man, popcorn. What kind of Lord of the Flies Bread and butter. Uh, what else? Some yeah. jelly beans. It looked like, like there was just some pretzels. candy on the... Leftover Halloween candy on the yeah. plate. Get your shit together, Snoopy. I thought you were a chef. <laughs> he is a chef. What? Yeah. Man, he's not, he's not a chef. He's like just that. a cool-ass dog. What What kind Joe of dog cool. was he? Like a... A, a beagle? A yeah, beagle. There the we go. Beagle. He was the dog. There we go. Thank you. Thank you. He was, a, he was Joe Cool. He's Joe Cool Beagle Joe Man. Cool. Beagleman. Oh, okay. He's a Beagleman. Beagleman. Yeah, Beagleman. A Beagleman. Okay. It's kind of dog. All right, Snoopy Beagleman. <laughs> <laughs> I uh, did you guys see that more recent Peanuts movie that came out? That that had a pretty neat animation style. It was it was kind of unique. It had that like kind of like flat two D 
Love. Uh, I, I really didn't even know they made that. Yeah, yeah I think I think I your kids were a little sleep. too young at the time. I think he was a little too old. What? No, like what, what does that have to do with anything? It was a little... <laughs> Blue Sky? I don't know. What does the Peanuts movie have to do with the Peanuts movie we watched? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I don't even know. Listen. Why talk about Peanuts when we're talking about Peanuts? Yeah, you know what? I love almonds. Uh, the... <laughs> okay, well, thank you guys for watching. If you want to check out some of our other holidays, of our holiday celebrations, so <laughs> some of our Halloween Redux episodes, some of all that, check, oh subscribe, look it up, look it up. That about does it though for a Charlie Brown Thanksgiving, the Peanuts movie that you guys apparently didn't even know existed. We'll talk about that. We'll talk about that another week, I guess. We'll talk about that one. If you want to find me anywhere, uh, at Just Gentile. It's not an anti-Semitic thing. It's just my name. <coughs> it's, it's, it's come up before in conversation. <coughs> I'm Jewish. Just go on. <coughs> uh, he's dying. My name is Byron. <laughs> underscore Lord. Okay, I'm ready. Uh, Derek Scott at underscore <laughs> the Derek Scott. Thank you. Thank you, Dealy Buddy. Thank you, The Fave. Thank you, Hollywood Redux. We'll see you next Happy week. Happy Turkey Day. Uh, eat more food. Smoke more.